Hello everyone, it's Jacob with the Game Block, and today I'm here to tell you Battlefront 2 mods are back. Though, some of you might not have even known they were gone in the first place. See, they were only broken on versions of the game that were not Steam. But on Steam, you won't have the problem of them not working. But, if you have the Epic Games or Origins versions of the game, then you will probably know if you have tried to attempt downloading mods that it is not working quite well. So today I'm going to tell you how to fix your mods on Battlefront 2. Now without further ado, let's move on to step 1. Please note, do not do these steps while you're watching the video. Please make sure to watch every step before you actually do any of this because that will be very important for this to work. Now, anyway, the first thing you would need to do is download Frosty Mod Manager. And to do that, there's a whole lot of steps. So, to explain it much better than I could, I have linked in the description a video by a YouTuber who goes by the name of Azatru. He explains it in a very easy to learn fashion, and that basically is how you download Frosty Mod Manager and such. But, once you reach a certain point in his video, typically when you try to run the mods, then things will start not working. So basically, what you're going to probably do is you're going to run the mods and Battlefront won't start up. So this is where Frosty Fix comes in. Frosty Fix is essentially a tool that fixes Frosty, as the name implies. Basically, it turns on the ability for Frosty Mod Manager to run the game again. And I'm going to be showing you how to download that and how you can have it fix Frosty. First, you're going to go to the link in the description for Frosty Fix, and you are going to download the main frostyfix.exe file. Don't download any of the other files, otherwise this won't work. Once you download Frosty Fix, you're going to want to open it, and your computer will likely warn you that it's possible this file is unsafe. I'm going to tell you it is not, because I actually have downloaded it twice to my computer, and I have checked, and it does not harm your computer. So, the only reason that it's telling you that it could harm your computer is because it's not on the browser's list of safe websites, even though it is a safe website. Anyway, then all you're going to have to do is just click multiple boxes saying just keep this file, and then you're going to open up Frosty Fix. Click the game you would like to fix mods for, in this case being Star Wars Battlefront 2, and then click Enable Mods. It's going to prompt you to either Restart Origin or Restart your PC. Restart Origin and then see if that works with your mods. If it doesn't, restart your PC. That should fix your mods. And with that, we have reached the end of our video. I hope mods work for you all, and that you download some pretty fun mods for yourselves, like I myself have been doing. In fact, every picture of a mod here you've seen today actually were screenshots taken by me. I've been downloading quite a few mods and testing them out, and I will be doing some videos on those soon. So, to make sure you stay updated on those, and other gaming news as well, please press that like button, subscribe, and press the notification bell, so then you stay updated for all my gaming videos. As well as, please follow me on Twitter at underscore GameBlog for more channel updates. With that out of the way, thank you all for watching. I'm Jacob with the GameBlog, signing off.